What you're looking at now may not be that recognizable to you. A sales center for Sun City Anthem used to stand here. But the building was recently demolished and now the site is being cleared because very soon they're going to build some homes here that were already pre-sold and I understand the lots with their spectacular view of the strip and the valley in the distance were very expensive. This is where our lovely sales pavilion once stood and perhaps you can see the gorgeous valley view in the distance uh, due to the work that's already underway I really can't get any closer than this. This is my friend Charlie. Uh, Charlie's up here a couple of days a week uh, selling entertainment books for the benefit of the Minuteman Foundation and of course that means the Community Service Club. Charlie, how are the sales going? Sales are going very well. Uh, in fact, uh, I would suggest that they get up here certainly in the first couple weeks of December because we might be gone by then, finished. Those entertainment books pay for themselves. I think even on the dry cleaning coupons you come out ahead just using those. Yes, you do. It's a pretty good deal. Okay, thanks, Charlie. Thank you. Have a I'm with Greg Dreyer, our activities director. Uh, Greg, I was just looking at the menu for New Year's Eve on the poster beside mm -hmm. you. Very impressive. How are the sales going? Well, we have about 266 people that have signed up so far out of the 600 that we're looking as a potential, so almost halfway there. So uh, if you want a table that, uh, that suits you, come on down now and, and sign up for it. My recollection is that uh, based on past years, our sales probably then are running better than they have in the past to have this many sold before the end of November? Sure, we're only 50 short or 60 short of what we had probably all last year, so we're Fantastic. doing very good. And it looks like a terrific deal for $90 if you're in the ballroom. Uh, what is it in the restaurant, an extra? It, it's another $10, it's $100 in the restaurant area. And that's a little bit more intimate dining. There'll be a few more favors in there. It'll be that a little is nicer. terrific. And then the week before New Year's on the 24th, all prices go up $20. That's just to encourage people to get their tickets early and so. get signed up. Greg, can you clear up this uh, little story I heard about uh, you and the Smith brothers? What's the deal with that? <laughs> Somebody said you don't like them. Oh, no, I love the Smith brothers. Uh, very entertaining, very talented musicians. And I do have them coming for an event on Leap Day, uh, which is February 29th. And they'll be here for a concert slash dance in the ballroom at Anthem Center. Uh, I like them just fine, but the group that we have coming out for our event, which is called Remember When, the dance band is Deja Vu, and so it fits. And they're Terrific. very energetic and very talented musicians. Smith Brothers were uh, kind of high priced this year, weren't they, for New Year's? Oh yeah, they're a little yeah. bit higher than so other bands. You made the best day you could, I think, for sure. both for our finances and for our enjoyment. Thanks very much, Greg. Thanks. And uh, have a good holiday. Thank you, you too.